from that end again, your CNA instructor. So the next procedure I'd like to go over with you is just to comb and brush a resident's hair. So we're not talking about anything hard, but there's specific directions you want to go so we don't cause them pain. So before any procedure, do your initial step. Ask your nurse about your resident's needs, abilities, and limitations. Knock on the door, wait for permission before entering. Introduce yourself by name and title, call them by the name they prefer, and explain what you're going to do. Find and gather your supplies. So for combing and brushing hair, I just need a comb and a towel. H, close those curtains, drape the doors, wash your hands, wear gloves as needed for body fluids, and use good body mechanics. So when we're combing their hair, you want their head up. If they're laying in the bed, put a towel over the pillow. Then take the comb, divide the hair into small sections, starting at the ends of the hair, working up toward the scalp. Section. Bottom up to the scalp. Bottom up. Section. Bottom up to the scalp. Now I'm just going to kind of show you on myself how you would comb somebody's hair if they were in a chair. So if they're sitting in a chair, Place the towel around their shoulders. Now you would remove any clips or hairpins that they may have, whether they're in bed or in the chair, but I just want to show you just kind of on myself. Take a small amount of hair, start at the bottom, work your way up to the scalp. Section, bottom, up to the scalp. And we would do that all the way around the head. When we're done combing their hair, we would ask them how they would like their hairstyle. And we knew we had it right because we would offer them a mirror to make sure that their hair was the way that they liked it. Do your final step. A, check alignment, make sure they're comfortable. B, make sure the bed's in the lowest position. C, make sure they have their call light and water. D, ask them if there's anything else they need before you go. And E, everybody deserves a thank you, so thank your resident. F and G, find and gather your supplies, payments to company or facility policy. H, ask them how they want those hanging curtains, open or closed. And then I your way out. I'm gonna wash my hands, I'm gonna do a visual safety check, Report unusual findings to my nurse and document my procedures. Thanks for watching.